And so here we are, back near the Mersey again. But this time we're on the opposite side of the river. And there's a bridge that we passed over some time ago in a different video. Today we're going this way. And so over there on the far side of the river is the uh, rowing club where we went a while ago and where Barney fell into the water and I had to drag him out. Not that he bothered him too much. He was too busy trying to catch a, a duck and say hello to a swan. But now we're on our way to a park where Barney's not been to before. So he's not quite sure which way to go, but hopefully we can uh, convince him to go the right way. Okay, so we've now walked across the park, uh, avoided all the nasty dogs, and now we're almost by the river again. We're getting quite close to the town centre, but now we're going to walk up here and go over a really cool Victorian suspension bridge. So here we are, going across this Victorian suspension bridge. I'm a bit paranoid, you might want to jump down and go in the river to uh, see some birds or whatever, some ducks and swans that you might find. So far, so good. I've got him a tight lead, so hopefully he can't jump in. And actually, this is quite a fun bridge because if you run across it or bounce across it, you can feel it bouncing as you walk across it. It's quite weird, but anyway. So yeah, so there's a Mersey, some new houses, and over the distance is the parish church, which I think is the third tallest steeple in the country, or something like that. Anyway. But anyway, let's keep on going. Well, I've just been very scared of a uh, cleaning machine that just went past there. So he ran away from that, and no surprise, it's quite noisy and horrible. So Barney here is desperate to get down there into that lovely water, but I'm not going to let him because he'll probably never get out again. Uh, but while he's sitting there, I can point out that the bridge we just walked over is just there. A nice old Victorian suspension bridge. And if we go the other way, um, the River Mersey goes around a bend just up there, and then it heads into town and onto the sea, to Liverpool. And in fact, just on that bend is where there's a weir. And that weir is the last point on the Mersey, which is still tidal. So beyond that point, you can get tides and salt water. And on this side, it's all fresh water. And so you get fish and whatever. And so Barney's just had a drink, and so did I. And now we're on our way back home again. Uh, back over the suspension bridge. As I say, a sort of Victorian footbridge that goes over the Mersey. And we're heading that way, over to the park, and then in the car and back home again. So here we are, back on the bridge again. I said it's quite funny, it sort of bounces along as you uh, walk across it. And that way is to sea, towards Liverpool, and that way is towards Manchester. But right now, we're in Warrington, close to the town centre, and we're heading this way, across the park, and eventually to my car, where we'll jump in and find our way home again. So Bonnie decided he didn't want to go home the way we came, so instead we've come a slightly different way and now we're quite close to this uh, posh restaurant that I think used to be a sort of mansion or something like that back in the day. Okay, so here we are back in the car. It's pretty warm in here today, so I think I'll have to get the windows open for him on the way home. Hey Barney? Yes, you. It's panting away. So let's put the old... get him nice and uh, cool. breeze for him and we'll soon be home won't we lad? 